Let's take a look at which fraction here is greater, 3 ninths or 7 twelfths. So first off, you could divide 3 by 4, get a decimal, 7 by 9, get a decimal, and compare these fractions, see which one's larger. You could also find a common denominator. Right now we have 4 and 9, but if this was the same, then we could just compare the numerators. So let's do that. Why don't we take 4 times 9? 4 times 9, that equals 36. And then down here, 9 times 4, which equals 36. So now we have the same denominator. But we can't just multiply the denominator by 4 here. We need to multiply the numerator by 4 as well. 4 over 4, it's just 1. Multiplying by 1 doesn't change the value, just the way it's represented. So 7 times 4, that's 28. 28 36, that's an equivalent fraction to 7 ninths. They have the same value. Up here, multiply by 9. And that gives us 3 times 9 is 27. Same denominator, compare the numerators. 28, that's larger than 36. Only by 1 36, but it's still larger. Since these are equivalent and these are equivalent, 7 ninths, that's larger than 3 fourths. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.